What's going on everyone, my name is Ovi and welcome to a new FIFA 19 tutorial on the channel guys In the next couple of minutes we're gonna talk about one of my favorite attacking moves Indeed, it is an advanced move, but with a bit of practice you will be able to master it I'm talking about the 90 degrees drag back And before we get started guys, I know all of you are football fans guys and you will love this app guys it's one of the only if not the only football app that i've got installed on my phone it's called one football and it's absolutely fantastic guys you've got everything over there you've got the news you can see all the latest news you can also select your favorite team guys and your national team and if you do that you will always stay up to date with all the news regarding those they also got the latest transfer rumors besides that you can also see the live scores from the games and uh, you've got other options like videos and other awesome things that uh, keep you in touch with the football community i will leave a link to this app in the description below make sure to check it out i'm sure you will love it and you will find it as you find my tutorials very very useful getting back to our tutorial as i told you this is one of my favorite moves to use in attack why is it one of my favorite moves well because it's so so bloody effective uh, guys and in order to perform a drag back you will have to press and hold on your controller the r1 button on your playstation 4 or rb on your xbox one controller guys after you've done that move the left analog towards the back of the player and when you see your player getting into this motion into this position right here move the left analog towards the left of the player or towards the right of the player depending where you want to do the half drag back as you are seeing in these examples the results are fantastic you are able to get past defenders fool them always keep them guessing and uh, also a big advantage of the 90 degrees drag back uh, turn is the fact that while you do this move you will have a ton of time to think about the shot, to properly load the shot, to properly aim the shot. It will give you a lot of time, which is extremely, extremely important in front of the goal. Uh, of course, I use this type of move also on the wing. It's effective over there, but it's at a most effective level in front of the goal, in front of the penalty box before performing a shot guys i wouldn't risk doing this um, in your own half or in the middle of the field try using this move only in front of the opponent's penalty box or inside of the penalty box this will be all for today guys don't forget to smash the like button thank you all for watching if you've got any questions make sure to follow me on twitter my name is ovi and i'll see you guys later